Okay, what's up guys? So today it's going to be a very, very quick look of how to set up a tanker in a circular or racetrack orbit in the mission header. So first things first, we're going to place our tanker down much like any other aircraft. So we select the aircraft. We're going to use... Minder, a KC-135 but with the uh, baskets. So we can just place it anywhere on the map if we want it to be activated straight away. Okay, so very important. That action that says tanker needs to be number one and we're going to set her up for 15,000 feet and a speed of yeah 430 that'll do we're just just a demo for this and we're going to place a waypoint one there and we're going to set a second waypoint just out of here okay so if we want a circular orbit all we're going to do is we're going to go onto advanced waypoint actions for waypoint two and we're going to press add then it'll be perform task and it's going to be orbit and from there we're going to check our speed so we're setting up a 430 so if we set that speed the same as the waypoint speed you won't get that sudden increase or decrease of speed when you're uh, talking to the tanker to get it to refuel you obviously altitude we want the same as what we'd like so 15,000 feet will do and that'll be a circular orbit at waypoint 2 however it's a pain in the ass trying to refuel from a tanker that's constantly going around in a circle so the way I tend to do it is if I delete that now if we go back to the to waypoint one so at least one waypoint back from the end and then we set up our perform action or perform task orbit this time our orbit will be a racetrack or we could circle obviously the benefit of a racetrack is it's going to come down between these waypoints it's going to turn around at waypoint two turn around at waypoint one it's going to keep that going basically until i tell it to stop and um, for the purpose of this we're just going to set it up so it will do that indefinitely once again we want to make sure the speeds relative to what we're trying to achieve so we'll leave it as 430 knots it'll do as close to or at 430 if it can and we're going to set it at uh, 15,000 feet and so if we select the tanker the comms frequency that you select in the comms panel will, uh, 251 will be the, the communication channel to talk to the tanker so obviously make sure it's set to a frequency that your aircraft can do uh, final thing if we select activate TACCAN and then press edit we can now set a TACCAN frequency so if we select 55 x-ray and we can actually call it so we'll call it tex and that's what will show up if your uh, aircraft can actually display a tac can call sign i think i believe the f-18 and the a-10 definitely can and i think the harrier might as well actually okay so really really simple so now we've got a tac can set up a couple of option, other options we can do so perform command we can change frequencies if we like however we're going to leave it as a default one that can that's really all we're really worried about for the tanker to be perfectly honest so at this way we can now find a find a tanker using tac can of 55 x-ray we can talk to him on 251 on an am radio and uh yeah he's going to refuel us so i'll quickly set up a demonstration to show that and uh yeah we'll see how it goes and guys so you can see presently our tank is currently at a turn at waypoint two however we're going to start talking to him so we've got I just select a manual frequency of 251 on radio 1 so if we just quickly go tanker into the field Texaco in field 1 1 request rejoin in field 1 1 Texaco proceed to pre-contact at 15,000 oh happy days and all we're going to do is we're going to get the pre-contact we're getting to drop the uh, basket and, and that's where we'll end the demonstration and such you don't need to see my piss poor attempts of air to air refueling Close the gap slightly. We're going to do this relatively quickly, just for the uh, for the sake of the video, as such. Put in quite a nice behind him. Either wing, generally speaking, he'll drop the basket on the left-hand wing before he does the right. So the second aircraft would always be on the right-hand wing normally to review. It would seem that he's already dropped the baskets ready. However, we'll roll with it. Get a little bit closer. Ready, pre contact. Are you going to let me do it from there or not? Return pre contact. Ready, pre contact. Contact. And clear contact, so now we can actually refuel from him. 
happy days. Okay then guys, so that was a really really quick video of how to create a tanker in an orbit of a circle or a racetrack and I hope it's been useful guys. So once again, like, subscribe and I'll see you next time.